Hi, this is Brian with Be Outdoors Alaska Channel. Today, me and my son Brock are heading from Seward over to Nanilchik for the 2024 Compassion Through Fishing Beach Tournament. Please come along with us as we spend 48 hours of non-stop fishing and try to catch the biggest fish we can in the top four. Hello, this is Brock from Be Outdoors Alaska and and these are some of the fish that we've caught. In this tournament, the top four fish in inches per team are added up and compared to each other. We can catch shark, skate, halibut, cod, and of course, sculpin. We just left Soldotna and we went uh, to, we went to Fred Meyer and went to Sportsman's Warehouse and met the Mickey D's. And now we're going to head to the beach and get our camp set up. We're on our way. Let the good times roll. We've been doing this for one year. Made it to the Nilchik and we got registered for this weekend. We stopped off at Three Bears and got some groceries for this weekend. So see y'all out there. We're just waiting for midnight so we can start catching some fish. And we're headed down towards the uh, state park. We're gonna head out and just kind of get set up for camp. It starts at midnight and we are, we are ready to go. From talking to some people, apparently the sharks are one of the larger fish that is caught and the skate. Um, so apparently one of the largest fish caught last year was 48 inches or something like that and it was shark so we'll see what happens this year i'd love to tie into some of the bigger fish what is that it's a skate it's a big skate hell yeah that's a good skate what was that 35 Bob just caught a nice old fat juicy cod, right? Hold that bugger up and give me a picture for you. Woo! <laughs> Jeez, dude, that's one that hold that butt up. We gotta measure that. Both of them hit at the same time. We're not even supposed to be fishing yet, man. That's the third flounder, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's the third one tonight. Pick that up, show us here. Smile, dude. Put the third flounder away. I don't think those are gonna help. But Two more spot. Some friends of ours, and uh, we've all been we're setting up. We got like 20 minutes, I think, or 30 minutes till uh, we can start keeping fish. So we've caught about 11 fish. Come back, everybody wants to win this tournament. So uh, hang around, and we'll show you how the adventure goes. morning low tide six in the morning tides out it's like glass pretty cotty flounder Here we are, Brock's over there doing a live on YouTube right now. Good news is he caught a halibut while it was live. They just caught a cod. They are managing it. What did Jordan get? The butt? It would have to be a butt. Where it's going on its way, that dude hit like a freight train. 
What do you got? A butt? At least you're being consistent. It's a butt. Dude, those, those guys in the boat are way out there. Nice. Hey, the tail looks concave. It's got my old mine in it when I just broke off. Oh, really? Yeah. That is awesome, baby, really. Woohoo! Get the butt! I don't think it's huge, but... Oh. What a beautiful, beautiful place. You cannot beat the scenery around here. Oh, nasty. Rock. Man, that's a big old sculpin, buddy. Look at the size of that creature. Well, there you go. A cup of cod. Another cod. <laughs> it's a... What you got, man? Back up. Uh -oh. Show us a good look. Look at this pretty little fish. Still here, it is about almost 10 o'clock Saturday night. We have until, I guess, 
noon tomorrow, but basically this tide at 140 is our our last full tide before it's time to wrap up. We are still here with other campers. Our guys are out of their trailers right now, but so check this out. We bought some burritos. Um, they're, sorry, we brought some chimichangas and I didn't know how to cook them, so I put a little water and I'm kind of like steaming them. And so far, it actually worked pretty good. I'm kind of surprised. These are a little camping still. Little MSR. I'm, I like that thing. Put that back in there. Okay, here we go. Rock out the halibut. There's a 28. Now we just got a whole bunch more to go, right? Yep. We just woke up. We're starting to get packed up, and I noticed all this water running down the beach. Holy cow, dude. This just slid down the beach. Our tent is right there. Yeah, right by our tent. That whole hill that came down. That's crazy. That. That is all we have left after the weekend fishing. We are down a slam picket. Everybody, a round of applause for Butch Lamb and the City. Woo! All right, let's get this started real quick. To all of our sponsors to help make all the prizes and this whole thing happen. Place team, how many of you have show of hands think you got it? Wow. <laughs> Lots of confidence in the audience, I see. Yeah, okay. All right. Well, let's get Team Spiky Dogfish up here, first place. $1,520. And, and they took it with $167. Holy oh God. God. Second place for $500. Chubby Butts. Chubby butt. That was 164.5 inches for the Chubby Butts. So I want to say that this young kid right here took his four wheeler down the beach and dug, dug all those tires you see out of my truck. Right there. That's taking care of the ecosystem. That's what we're about. He gets an extra hundred dollars. We're looking for the J and B show. Third place, 163.5 inches. Dude, how many sharks were there? Go ahead and get Team Madeiros up. They got sixth place for 143 and a half inches. Seventh place, we got Team Tuck Fluck. 130.5. Come on up, guys. It's Team Ahmed with the exact same 130.5. You guys come on up. What do I get? In ninth place, we got Ain't Caught Shh for 127. They didn't give it. Come on up, guys. One. No, there were two. In place, we got Be Outdoors Alaska at 125. Hey, what's up? Be Outdoors here. Be Outdoors, what's up, boys? Eleventh place, we got Stream Butts. Come on up, guys. 122.5. In 12th place, we got salt and pepper. You catch your fly rod? 122.0. Come on up, guys. <laughs> and in 13th, we got Ice Maiden's Fury at 121.0. Come on up. Yep. 
Sweet, bud. 14th place, we got the Halibut Henchman at 120. Since we had one team not here for their stuff, we're going to go to the next one. It's Team I Don't Know. They're officially now 14th place at 117.75. Rock and I want to thank everyone for coming on this adventure with us. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It was a lot of fun to participate in the beach cleanup, and we look forward to next year's tournament. If this video was of interest, please watch some of our other videos. Now let's go be outdoors in Alaska.